Following the harsh separatist occupation and blockade of Ryloth, the Republic sent a massive attack force to retake the planet. Anakin Skywalker, Obi-Wan Kenobi, and Mace Windu would all serve different roles in the invasion of the planet. Anakin Skywalker and the 501st Legion led the attack on the Techno-Union blockade. The initial assault of V-19 Torrent Starfighters were all but decimated by the Confederate forces, who also managed to destroy both the Redeemer and Defender Republic Star Destroyers. Anakin eventually managed to destroy the blockade by ramming the aforementioned Defender Star Destroyer into the central command station of the Confederate forces. With the blockade clear, Obi-Wan and the 212th Attack Battalion started their initial descent into the planet's surface, but were stalked by heavy anti-air proton cannons who were shielded by local Twi'lek inhabitants. Obi-Wan and his clone troopers, who were already on the ground, managed to launch a sneak attack on the anti-air positions and destroy the heavy cannons, freeing the Twi'lek locals along the way. With the proton cannons wiped out, Mace Windu and Lightning Squadron commenced their attack in the capital city of Lasu, which was heavily guarded by Confederate armor and infantry. Without Republic forces in the area and the firebombing of nearby villages, Miss Windu enlisted the help of well-known resistance leader on Ryloth, Cham Sindula. With the help of partisan fighters, the Republic was able to retake the capital in a hard-fought battle. Following the successful liberation of Ryloth, the planet readopted a democratic government. For more videos like this, make sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel.